Good instructions given by the ref in the early going. Mike gets it with the right hand, and ATN is down. He was really nailed with a foot right hand. It's up to five, and six, he's not going to make it. It's seven, eight, nine, and ten. He knocks him out in the first round. Ladies and gentlemen, the bout ends at two minutes, 32 seconds of the opening round. Right hand to the side of the jaw. A clip it at the end. I knew I hit you with a good shot. You took it. You took it. I'm a I respect, hey, I respect that. I respect that. The clash between Jake Paul and Mike Tyson is finally here. This is an unprecedented event in the boxing world, with a young internet sensation taking on the legendary former heavyweight champion. The fight, rescheduled due to Tyson's health issues, has finally arrived, and the atmosphere is electric. Fans from all walks of life are glued to their screens, eager to witness this unique matchup between two vastly different fighters. The stakes are incredibly high for both men, each with something significant to prove. From the opening bell, it's clear that Mike Tyson's experience and background in the sport of boxing give him a significant edge over Jake Paul. Tyson moves with a predatory grace, reminiscent of his prime years, and immediately takes control of the ring. His footwork is impeccable, cutting off Paul's avenues of escape and forcing the younger fighter to engage on his terms. The sheer presence of Tyson is overwhelming as he begins to dictate the pace with his signature aggression. Paul, despite his best efforts, finds himself on the defensive from the outset. Tyson's jab is sharp and accurate, setting up powerful combinations that keep Paul on his back foot. The legendary fighter's ability to slip punches and counter with devastating precision is a sight to behold. Tyson's body shots are particularly punishing, each one drawing a wince from Paul and sapping his energy. The young fighter's attempts to establish his own offense are quickly neutralized by Tyson's superior ring craft. As the rounds progress, Tyson's dominance becomes even more apparent. His punches come in relentless flurries, each one carrying the weight of his decades of experience. Paul struggles to mount any significant offense, his punches often missing their mark or being deflected by Tyson's impeccable defense. The gap in skill and experience is stark, and Paul finds himself increasingly outmatched. Tyson's power and precision are unrelenting, each punch a reminder of why he was once the most feared man in the ring. The fourth round sees Tyson ramping up his assault, his eyes gleaming with the intensity of a seasoned warrior. Paul, visibly exhausted and battered, tries to keep his guard up, but Tyson's relentless pressure breaks through. The crowd is on their feet, sensing that the end is near. Tyson's punches come in rapid succession, each one finding its mark with brutal efficiency. Paul's corner watches in concern, knowing that their fighter is in deep trouble. As the fifth round begins, Tyson wastes no time in pressing the attack. He corners Paul against the ropes, unleashing a barrage of hooks and uppercuts. Paul's attempts to clinch and survive are futile against Tyson's ferocity. The arena is electric with anticipation, every fan on the edge of their seat. Tyson delivers a devastating right uppercut, followed by a left hook, sending Paul crashing to the canvas. The referee begins the count, and it becomes clear that Paul is struggling to recover. The knockout victory for Mike Tyson is a testament to his enduring prowess and fighting spirit. Even at 58, Tyson has shown that he still possesses the power and skill that made him a champion. The fight is a reminder of Tyson's legendary status in the sport of boxing, a final act of defiance against time and doubt. For Paul, the defeat is a humbling experience, highlighting the vast difference between a seasoned boxing legend and a determined newcomer. Tyson's triumph is celebrated by fans and analysts alike who marvel at his ability to dominate a fighter decades as junior. The victory adds another illustrious chapter to Tyson's storied career, reinforcing his legacy as one of the greatest boxers of all time. The fight also serves as a cautionary tale for Paul, illustrating the immense challenges that come with facing a true boxing icon. Despite his previous successes, Paul is reminded that there are levels to the sport that experience and pedigree cannot easily bridge. In the aftermath, the boxing world buzzes with the implications of the fight. Tyson's victory opens the door for more high-profile matches, potentially attracting other big names to the ring. The financial success of the event highlights the immense marketability of crossover bouts, 
blending sports and entertainment in a way that captivates audiences. For Paul, the path forward will require introspection and strategic planning as he contemplates his next move in the wake of a crushing defeat. Discussions about the fight dominate the sports world, with analysts dissecting every aspect of the bout. Tyson's performance is hailed as a masterclass in boxing technique and ring generalship. Fans debate the significance of the fight for both men's careers, with many praising Tyson's timeless skill and Paul's courage to step into the ring with a legend. The event is remembered as a historic showdown, bringing together different generations and styles in a captivating display of the sport's enduring allure. For Paul, the lessons learned from facing Tyson will be invaluable. The experience of sharing the ring with a legend provides a unique perspective on the sport and its demands. Paul's resilience and willingness to take on formidable challenges will likely earn him respect in the boxing community, despite the defeat. Moving forward, Paul will need to reassess his strategies and continue honing his skills if he hopes to reach the pinnacle of the sport. The fight's financial implications are significant as well. The pay-per-view numbers and global attention highlight the immense marketability of both fighters. A successful event paves the way for more crossover bouts and special attractions in boxing, blending the lines between sports and entertainment. The revenue generated will have a lasting impact on the careers of both fighters and the future of boxing events. For Tyson, the victory reaffirms his place in the pantheon of boxing greats. His ability to compete and win at such an advanced age is a testament to his dedication and passion for the sport. The fight solidifies his legacy, not just as a former champion, but as a timeless icon of boxing. Tyson's journey from the streets of Brooklyn to the top of the boxing world, and now to a triumphant return, is a story that continues to inspire and captivate fans around the globe. In the grand narrative of boxing, the fight between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul stands as a unique and compelling chapter. It is a clash of eras, a meeting of youth and experience, and a testament to the enduring appeal of the sweet science. As the dust settles and the world reflects on the bout, the echoes of Tyson's victory will resonate through the annals of boxing history. The fight between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul is generating immense buzz in the boxing community. Compared to traditional boxing matches, this spectacle promises a heightened anticipation for what will be a clash of generations, with the legendary Tyson stepping back into the ring to face the young and ambitious Paul. The fight will be broadcast on Netflix, adding a new dimension to the way boxing is consumed by audiences worldwide. The stakes are incredibly high for both fighters, as a victory or defeat could significantly impact their careers and legacies. Mike Tyson, at 58 years old, remains one of the most iconic figures in boxing history. Known for his ferocious power and intimidating presence, Tyson's return to the ring is a major event in itself. Despite his age and the health issues that led to the fight's postponement, Tyson's experience and skill make him a formidable opponent. His training videos have shown flashes of the speed and power that made him a champion, suggesting that he is taking this comeback seriously. For Tyson, this fight is not just about nostalgia. It's an opportunity to demonstrate that he still has the prowess to compete at a high level. On the other side of the ring, Jake Paul represents the new wave of boxing. With a 9 hour null one professional record, Paul has quickly become a polarizing figure in the sport. His victories over former UFC fighters and a professional boxer have established him as a serious contender, despite the criticism he faces from traditional boxing purists. Paul's journey from YouTube fame to the boxing ring has been marked by controversy and spectacle, but he has shown a dedication to improving his skills and proving his doubters wrong. Facing Tyson is by far the biggest challenge of his career, and a win would elevate his status to unprecedented levels. The dynamics of this fight are fascinating. Tyson's style is rooted in explosive power and aggressive offense, while Paul has shown a more calculated approach in his fights, relying on his reach and improving technique. Tyson's strategy will likely involve closing the distance quickly and unleashing his powerful combinations, aiming to overwhelm Paul early in the fight. For Paul, the key will be to maintain distance, use his jab effectively, and avoid getting caught in Tyson's relentless attacks. This tactical battle will be crucial in determining the outcome, as both fighters bring very different strengths and weaknesses to the ring. The significance of this fight extends beyond just the competitors. 
For Tyson, a victory would affirm his legacy and potentially open the door for more high-profile fights, cementing his status as one of the greatest boxers of all time. However, a loss could raise questions about the wisdom of his return to the ring at his age, potentially tarnishing his storied career. For Paul, defeating a legend like Tyson would be a monumental achievement, silencing many of his critics and solidifying his place in boxing history. Conversely, a loss could undermine his progress and credibility, making it difficult to secure future big-name opponents. The lead-up to this fight has been marked by intense training camps and public statements from both fighters. Tyson's preparation has been focused on regaining his physical condition and refining his technique, ensuring that he can still deliver the devastating punches he is known for. Paul's camp, meanwhile, has emphasized the importance of conditioning, strategy, and mental preparation. Understanding the gravity of facing a legend, Paul has been working on enhancing his defensive skills and endurance to withstand Tyson's onslaught. The contrast in their preparations underscores the unique challenges each fighter faces in this bout. Public perception of this fight is a mix of excitement and skepticism. Many fans are thrilled at the prospect of seeing Tyson in the ring again, eager to witness his legendary power and charisma. There is also significant interest in whether Paul can rise to the occasion and prove himself against such a renowned opponent. However, some critics argue that the fight is more of a spectacle than a legitimate sporting contest, questioning the motivations behind the matchup. Regardless, the fight has captured the public's imagination, drawing attention from both boxing enthusiasts and casual fans. The financial implications of this fight are substantial. With the bout being broadcast on Netflix, it represents a new model for boxing promotions, potentially reaching a broader and more diverse audience than traditional pay-per-view. The involvement of a major streaming platform underscores the commercial appeal of this fight and highlights the evolving landscape of sports entertainment. Both Tyson and Paul stand to gain significant financial rewards, further incentivizing their commitment to making the fight a memorable event. This shift in broadcasting also reflects the changing ways in which audiences consume sports content, pointing to a future where streaming services play a more prominent role in major events. As the fight date approaches, the media coverage and promotional activities will intensify, building hype and anticipation. Both fighters are adept at engaging with the media and their fans, using social media and public appearances to drum up interest. Tyson's storied past and Paul's knack for controversy make them compelling figures in the lead up to the fight. This pre-fight period will be crucial for setting the narrative and generating excitement, with each fighter aiming to position themselves as the favorite in the eyes of the public. The psychological aspect of this fight cannot be overlooked. Tyson's presence alone can be intimidating, given his reputation and past achievements. Paul will need to manage the mental pressure of facing such a legendary figure, maintaining his composure and confidence. Tyson, on the other hand, must prove that he can still perform at a high level despite his age and recent health issues. The mental battle will be as important as the physical one, with each fighter needing to stay focused and execute their game plan under immense pressure. The outcome of this fight will have far-reaching implications for the boxing world. A victory for Tyson could reignite interest in older fighters making comebacks, potentially leading to more matchups involving retired champions. It would also reinforce the notion that age is just a number, inspiring a new generation of fighters. For Paul, a win would be a game changer, legitimizing his career and potentially setting up future high-profile bouts. It would demonstrate that his transition from social media star to professional boxer is more than a gimmick, solidifying his place in the sport. The training regimens of both fighters have been a focal point of pre-fight discussions. Tyson's training has been grueling, with a focus on regaining his physical condition and honing his boxing skills. His videos have shown impressive speed and power, suggesting that he still possesses the tools that made him a champion. Paul's training has also been intense, with a focus on improving his technique and conditioning. He has been working with top trainers to prepare for the unique challenge that Tyson presents, aiming to be in peak condition for the fight. The broader cultural impact of this fight is significant. It represents a clash of eras with Tyson embodying the old-school, hard-hitting style of boxing and Paul representing the new wave of digital-age fighters. 
This generational showdown highlights the evolving nature of the sport, where traditional boundaries are being challenged and new opportunities are emerging. The fight's outcome could influence how future matchups are perceived and promoted, shaping the direction of boxing in the coming years. The anticipation for this fight is palpable, with fans eagerly awaiting the showdown. The combination of Tyson's legendary status and Paul's controversial rise creates a compelling narrative that transcends the sport itself. As the fight date draws nearer, the excitement will only continue to build, culminating in what promises to be an unforgettable event. Whether it's Tyson's comeback or Paul's attempt to prove his critics wrong, the fight will undoubtedly be a defining moment in both their careers. The fight between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul is a monumental event in the boxing world. It's a clash of generations, styles, and personalities that has captured the public's imagination. The stakes are incredibly high for both fighters, with significant implications for their careers and legacies. As the anticipation builds, the boxing community and fans worldwide eagerly await to see who will emerge victorious in this epic showdown.